I'm Levi, a creative, adventure seeker, and explorer by heart. A few years ago, I set out on a mission, a mission to find the most unusual, inspired, and unique one night stays in America. And I'm taking you with me. This is Tiny b, &B. Let's go. Welcome to the Acorn Tree House at Honey Tree Farms. Let's go check this place out. Today we are in Fredericksburg, Texas, one of my favorite spots. I love visiting Texas and we're at Honey Tree Farms today. They have several really cool tree houses and today I'm going to be taking a tour of the Acorn Tree House, their newest tree house on this property. It is three levels of tree house. The middle level is your living space and there is an outdoor area at the bottom and an outdoor area on top of this tree house it is about 300 square feet of living space so this is definitely a tiny house tree house so i think it's really cool along with the tour the entrance to your tree house is absolutely beautiful nature has perfectly placed two trees to kind of arch over the walkway and there's lights strapped all around them and even a lantern at top and you walk under this walkway and then your tree house gets revealed as you walk and it's so beautiful the lights around the tree house at night the spot glows in the dark and it stands out amongst the trees it looks like you're in a fairy tale or some sort of wonderland it is really cool so we'll walk up and at the bottom level the first thing on the right before we enter the spiral staircase is your first outdoor area now this is a really unique spot you have this custom made huge sliding door and you open it up and you enter into your outdoor enclosed area i would say over on the left side you have a swinging chair at the bottom you have a grill and an eating area and then on the right side, you have your outdoor bathtub. This is a really neat and fun spot to have. I love the hex honeycomb looking uh, windows everywhere. That's because this is Honey Tree Farm, so they do the honeycomb looking windows. It is really beautiful. That is my favorite detail of their tree houses. So we'll take a step out of that and we'll walk up the spiral staircase now. And this gives you a good look of all the nature around you. And then you enter into your second level, which is your main level. Let's take a step through this door and we'll check out what the inside has to offer. When you walk inside, you'll enter your kitchenette space. Now, like I said, this is definitely considered a tiny house. For your kitchenette, you have your sink right across from your door, and then you have these floating shelves above you that have all of your dishes, and you have the really cool custom-made cabinets underneath with your mini fridge, and then on the other side, you have all of your coffee making supplies so you can still have coffee in the mornings but this is definitely a romantic retreat a weekend getaway and who wants to cook giant meals on a weekend romantic retreat <laughs> And then we'll walk out of that and now we enter into your main living space. This is your bedroom and living space all in one. Right in the middle they have a gigantic king size bed. It's pretty impressive that they fit that in a 300 square foot floor plan. And they have this net that goes all the way around it that just adds to the romantic vibe to this place. And the huge window on the side of the bed lets in all the light and you can see beautiful nature around. And then on the right of this, you have a small dining area, which is impressive that they fit that in here as well. So this is your living space, places to sit, places to sleep and relax and be romantic. And then now... Well, I think this place, what makes this place very, very unique. If you look on the other side, you have your bathroom space, and then this is where your revealing shower is located. This is definitely a romantic retreat because this is a, an all-glass shower for you and your partner, which is really fun if you're here like on a honeymoon or something. So I think this is a really cool aspect. I've never seen this anywhere else. And if you really want to, there are curtains to close this if it must be done but it's super neat that you have a shower out in your bedroom and living space that you can look into it's kind of interesting now I'll walk into your bathroom this is a pretty spacious bathroom beautiful tiling everywhere around this corner you have your toilet and then of course your 
gorgeous shower. You have this arched tile way when you walk into it, and then the tile work on the bottom and just all around it is absolutely beautiful. And then of course, you can see your living space and dining space whenever you're in your shower. So that is all 300 square foot of your living space. Very unique. And now we'll take a step out of that and we'll walk up the rest of the stairs to your top level of your tiny house treehouse. When you reach this top level, you have a couple seats up here to enjoy as you are at the very tip top of the trees around you. It is really cool being up here, kind of like in a bird's nest up here, a crow's nest, surrounded by the sky and the beautiful trees. And then over on this right side, you can enter into this small arched way door into your patio area. This is more specifically the crow's nest, which is really cool. You have a bed over here on the left, you have a small clay fire pit area over here, and then another swinging chair up here, all enclosed with this beautiful opening on this side that lets you look into the trees, and of course the honeycomb windows everywhere. This spot is a really nice relaxing area, especially being up so high in the trees. And it's enclosed, so rain, shine, you can come out here. You could probably even sleep out here if you really wanted to enjoy that. But that is the third level of this treehouse. And it's awesome that there are even three levels to this tiny house treehouse. So that is your Acorn Treehouse located in Fredericksburg, Texas. I thought this space was really cool and unique. And now let's go check out the other treehouse right next door and see what that one has to offer. We are at the Leaf Tree House in Fredericksburg, Texas. So let's go check this place out and see what it has to offer. We're in Fredericksburg, Texas once again today at the Leaf Tree House right behind me. This tree house has three separate levels. The middle level is your living space and it has about 300 square feet of living space. The upper level has a bathtub up there and is a really cool lookout spot. So we're gonna be taking a tour of this place today. We're about 10 minutes outside of the main strip in Fredericksburg, Texas, the hill country, the beautiful wine country they say. And you arrive onto your property and you'll see all the other tree houses and then you'll park at your own tree house, the leaf. And you'll walk down your walkway and you'll see your beautiful lit up tree house all amongst the live oak trees everywhere. You're very surrounded by the nature and I've seen lots of wild animals here, which is really cool. You walk down your walkway though, it's this really cool designed path, and then you have your three-story treehouse. There's lights everywhere at night. This place looks really cool. You have a spiral staircase that goes up to your main level, but we'll start on the bottom level first, which is your first outdoor space. So you just have this entire decked out space. You have a hammock over here, and you have a couple seating options and a grill over here as well. And this is a cool hangout spot, and then you can kind of come off over here and look up at your treehouse. You'll see the really cool architecture and even the round window. That's my favorite part of this treehouse, which we will get to, which is inside. So now let's just take a step up these steps and enter into the middle level, which is your living space. You walk past all the lights and the cool trees coming out of the decks and you walk inside and this is where your 300 square foot of living space is. This is a tiny house tree house for sure. Definitely a tiny house tree house. And you walk in and this is a really open design concept and there's a lot of cool things about this tiny house tree house in here. So you walk right into your kitchenette space. Now since this is only 300 square feet of living space, you can't really fit a full kitchen in here. So of course you have a kitchenette with really cool cabinets on this bottom. I love the design of this really intricate wood detail of these cabinets. And then my favorite thing in this kitchenette is this sliding out uh, chopping board area. This adds so much more countertop space to this area and it's just so easy to pull in and out. I thought this was a genius idea and it's so simple. I've never seen this in other tiny houses. This is such a simple idea that works really well. And then you have, of course, your sink, all your coffee supplies, and then you have shelves up here that house all your dishes and other things you might need. There is a hot plate and a microwave here too for anything else you might need to cook. 
Off to the right is your bathroom. You'll open up this door, and this is a spacious bathroom for a 300 square foot floor plan. Uh, it's pretty open. Right in front of you is your vanity with this live edge wood top piece. You got the green paint and the gold accents everywhere, the toilet on your right, and I just love the tiling in here. The tiling is beautiful. And one thing to note about the toilet actually, once you sit down on the toilet, the toilet paper holder is right in front of you. I've never noticed such a luxury until I've had this right here because you sit down, it's just <laughs> in front of you so easy access anyway and then on the other side is your shower now this shower takes up this entire side and you have the beautiful tiling all around it and then of course the arched walkway that leads into the shower with this brown tile it looks absolutely beautiful in here once you're done in the bathroom You'll walk out and now you have your main sleeping slash living space over here on the left side is your king size bed. I am very surprised they could fit a king size bed in such a small living space, but that just adds to the luxury of the stay. You have nice stands on each side, the really cool green wall with the wood accents on the corners look really cool, the detail, and of course the string lights that go above the bed with a canopy net that surrounds the bed as well in case you want to get romantic and you like this stuff or you can kind of just tuck it away and leave it as is but on the other side of this is now my favorite part of this whole tree house it is this reading nook with the round window this is such a cozy little spot the bed is really neat with all the pillows and just the window is huge actually and it lets you look out into the Texas hill country nature and you can't see anybody any of the other tree houses when you're at your own tree house which is really neat this spot is awesome and the string lights above it just add to the touch now we'll go check out the third level so now we'll head out and walk up these steps onto the top level this is a really romantic spot as well there's lots that they offer up here you got the beautiful tile on the ground your day bed in the corner a swinging chair and then your outdoor bathtub this is a pretty large bathtub there's string lights that surround all of this and of course your fire pit right in the middle of all of this up here and you're right at the tree line basically so you can see the trees and you can see over the trees as well this is a really cool spot to hang out at have a fire take a bath up here swing in the chair it's really cool. So that is your leaf tree house that is 300 square feet of living space. Very similar layout to the acorn tree house that I've showed you guys, but very different on the insides and what it offers. So I hope you enjoyed the space and guys have a great rest of your day.